guys welcome back to the channel hope all of you are having a great day now if you missed the last upload down in texas here is a quick little recap perfect Car, this gray viper is exactly my car like the same spec uh not uh you know the looks of the car obviously mine's an acr and all but um the, the same build so same exact power basically my car will make around 1100 on pump gas it'll make around 1300 wheel on e85 just regular pump e85 um so that's pretty insane and that's what this car same package as this uh, the gray car and it was nuts now the only there is one difference but let me show you the ride along first. Here we go. So I'm gonna show you some features real quick about some stuff. Okay. So um, Colin's firmware, the way it's set up is, Colin designed the whole thing himself. Um, engineering is the name of his company. Okay. So you hold the cancel button down and it basically goes into this mode where you can switch through the maps, right? So- And the one, maps are numbered like with the- The tack, yep. Okay, So wow. we're gonna be on map five, but oil pressure turns into your ethanol content. So we're at like E25 right now. So it's a, we're gonna be paid basically on pump gas. So okay. 1100 wheel. Okay, oh, you know, no big deal. Just 1100 wheel. <laughs> uh, so this is gonna be much faster than my ZR1 and that this car is lighter than that. Um, okay, oh Jesus. I'd be lying if I said I wasn't a little bit nervous. <laughs> oh my God, but it's gonna be awesome. So my car with the right fuel is gonna make like, and this car too. Another like 150 wheel okay, over wow. this. Yeah, so like 1300-ish. Oh my God. That's insane, holy crap. And then downshifts. Oh my God. That is so crazy. Oh my God. <laughs> Well, first time ever in a sequential car, and that's an experience. It gives you like it's the smooth. feel. Everybody thinks yeah. you're really clunky. We've gotten them down to kind of this. I mean, it's still a racing clutch or a racing transmission. Like you can feel it, but it's not. It's bad. not it, it's extremely bad. Some people it drives them nuts, but that wouldn't drive me nuts because I like my SVJ old school. You can feel it. It's kind of like that. But it shifts much faster. But way faster. Yeah, way faster. Wow, that's freaking incredible. Oh my god, this setup is friggin' gnarly. I 
can't even imagine a car with like 3,000. Oh, uh, it's fun. So you can use that all the time? Yeah. Because I'll be doing that. Like, <laughs> still warning, I'll be doing that every day of my life, uh, two-stepping the car. So then if you're like doing a roll race, would you hold that in? Yeah, okay. hold it. I'll, I'll, I'll do it with you on the highway. Okay. All right, well, we'll get a, a quick lesson here in how to roll race a Viper. idea you have no idea how fast this car is and this isn't even on like the full e this is down like a hundred horsepower from where it could be on full e it's unreal like you've been in my zr1 yeah fast car it's fast yeah this is so drastically different and how's it different what's it, what makes I, it i'd different? say the big difference is like seating position no just the faster you go in this car the faster, the faster it goes <laughs> Like instead of getting to 130, 140 and, you, and kind of slows down, because of the way it, it applies power, you only get faster the faster you go because it can give more boost. Right. It's insane. I've never felt a car that you go faster and it gets faster. How's it hook? Amazing. You're gonna absolutely flip out. <laughs> Dude, I flipped out and I'm used to cars that are pretty fast. This is unreal. <laughs> He can tell you, I was screaming in the car. I was Baby like, dick package. Let me throw, yeah. uh, let, me get some, <laughs> let me get some ethanol in it and um, I'll, uh, we'll take one of the other guys out. The plaid, my car, 
they're fast and they you know they they get going um but you notice they dramatically they drastically rather slow down as you get to 110 20 30 mile an hour you this is it's only getting warmed up at 130 like you hit 130 and then the car's like all right now we can really go as fast as we can I'm ready to go. you're gonna love it that's, yeah. small that's the small peen package small peen this is the baby package i'm starting out with this and uh I mean, it's like the numbers don't, don't even pay attention to like the horsepower. It, none of that matters. The numbers don't matter at all. This is a different world. We interrupt this program for an important news announcement. Time is running out for you to win this truck, this beautiful 2020 Ram 3500 Limited plus 10 grand in cash. Odie says, you got to enter, so make sure you do hit that link down below and you could be the next owner of this truck and the cash. It's a pretty sweet deal. Get anything on the website, get something cool, and you could win that truck plus a whole lot of money. Got the key tags, remove before flight, pull to eject, really cool in there. Uh, student driver, hearing loss may occur, another favorite. Uh, we've got Power Stroke, Dirty Max, we've got Racing Babe, uh, Girls Do It Better, LGB key tag, uh, Blue Line Flag, Gray Flag, Odie Green, Tan, and uh, my personal favorite, the Come and Take It Tropical key tag, great colors. Check out this bad boy right here, the new 717 Whiskey Hoodie. Sip your coffee on them nice ranch mornings and the 717 Come and Take It Tumbler for you as well. Keep your drinks nice and warm or cold. Just in for you, the new wallets, the OD Green, the chrome red right here, the forged carbon with blue flake, and the forged with red flake, all brand new, just put up on the site. We have the Arugas wing sauce, or whatever you wanna put it on, it doesn't have to be wings. Uh, Arugas is a famous wing place by us, and we here at InshaneDesigns.com exclusively sell their sauce nationwide. Make sure you try it out, the almost everything, the kangaroo sauce, the honey barbecue, and the kinda hot. Tropical AR come and take it shirt, the bakery AK-47 shirt, and we have both of those in a hoodie if you want a hoodie instead. No matter how dirty your vehicle is, we've got you covered with the full 717 detail line, the wheel and soot cleaner, our best product, I think, the interior cleaner, the classic detail spray, the glass cleaner, the car wash concentrate, and the bug cleaner. Make sure you try that stuff out. Everyone who gets it loves it. Don't forget your microfiber to go with it. Thankfully, we have these now. Uh, we had a lot of trouble getting them because we wanted, you know, a good quality one. We didn't want like the crappy little ones. And you can see it's really nice and thick, holds a lot of water. Um, so yeah, if you're getting detail stuff, don't forget your microfiber. We like to keep it fair and balanced, so we only ever do every $1 spent equals one entry, or every $1 equals five entries, and right now, it is five times entry week, and most of our winners do enter and win during the five times entry week period, so get entered right now. Again, anything that you see on the website counts. Every $1 spent equals five automatic entries to win this truck, plus 10 grand in cash. <laughs> crazy was it wild yeah to get on video yeah how was it a lot it was really fun <laughs> <laughs> i can't wait for yours to be done because that means i get to ride in it yeah was that it? was the craziest thing was it crazy ever. that was insane yeah it was some heat the two-step i can't Rolling wait to step. i can't wait to see your footage it's gold it's a big above oh i like to scratch oh so texas was freaking awesome i loved it now i am back home unfortunately with the cold and the snow um but texas was really cool i do plan to go back i want to visit uh calvo again maybe even get the car myself i feel like would be really fun go down there drive it and then uh bring it back on a trailer because uh the car is literally like 90 percent done now after the day after i left which was only two days two days ago uh the turbos went in and a lot of the piping went in. Like that car is really close to getting done. It's a very quick build. Um, I'm kind of shocked, actually. I was not planning to have it back this soon, but as you saw, I mean, they wasted no time. Really gotta go back to Texas. That place was really cool, and I wanna see more about it. Those highways are a dream come true. I can see why the racing scene down there is the way it is. I mean, it's 
pretty nuts. And also I saw uh, the new Tesla factory, Giga Texas, I think it's called. That building is insane. Like it's really hard to actually describe how big it is, but it's the biggest building I've ever seen in my life by far. Like we were driving doing 90 miles an hour and it took us like a full minute to pass the building. It's so freaking massive. And then you have your own, it, they have their own road there, Tesla Road, which was uh, really cool. I was absolutely uh, stunned at that car and not, I wasn't trying to play it up for the camera or anything. It was just so fast. <laughs> And again, the big difference was like with my ZR1 or the Plaid, uh, both very fast. Those are the, the fastest cars I've ever been in. So that's why I keep uh, mentioning those. That, that's really all I can compare it to. That is the, that's what I've been in. Um, but with those cars, like they're really fast, but they do start to die out. Like the Plaid around like 140 gets pretty slow. Like you can really feel it. The ZR1, you know, around 160-ish, you can feel it slow down a little bit. The Viper, just it only got faster because that Motec system, once you're going faster, you can add more power. The only difference is, now I did say there was one big difference between the gray car and my car. That is the trans. decided behind the scenes, I know I was going back and forth. I decided I wasn't going to do the sequential because I have the ZR1. That's an auto car. I figured having a six speed, a real six speed car would be fun. However, after being in the sequential, I think I need it. So please let me know in the comments, which one you would rather see uh, on the channel. I think, believe it or not, I think a lot of you are going to say the sequential, uh, you, like rowing gears is fun, but that sequential was nuts and it felt like a real friend <laughs> felt like an absolutely real uh real race car um so that's the only difference but after being in the car with the sequential and i'm really glad i went down there because you know i wouldn't want to get it and then not be happy with it or you know have to send it back um i think the sequential is the move uh, again let me know what you think in the comments but i feel like I need that. It was just, it was just psh, 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 like, it's so freaking, I loved it. I absolutely loved it. And I think I need a sequential. So uh, good research. I went down there, experienced a car, and now I know what I need for mine because I feel like I just, I have this feeling if I get the car back and it doesn't have the sequential, I'm going to be sitting there thinking the whole time that I wish I had it. And that's what I don't want to do. I don't want to you know, if you're gone, if you're doing all this, like do it right. Hope you guys enjoyed this. Oh my God. Hope you guys enjoyed this upload. Uh, Boog and I both appreciate you watching. Uh, and also don't forget, we're almost at the end of January. Time is running out for you to win our 2020 Ram 3500 Limited plus 10 grand in cash. Five times entries is live right now. Every $1 that you spend on the website, link down below gets you five automatic entries to win this truck plus 10 grand. And uh, you're gonna like that truck. I'll see you very soon to hand you the keys. Anyway, make sure to like this video for the Twin Turbo Viper and for Boog. Uh, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Take care.